Alright, so we just hooked into this guy right here. It's a little bit small. Like a pound? It's about a pound. Alright, he's on the next day. It's not a big one, but people come up. Having some Betsy, that thing. Follow up, follow up. Here. Hold, reel down and pull up. Okay, you need me to get a little strong. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, it's pulling. Nice when size. Pulling, you don't. Don't reel. Okay, now, now lift up. Lift up. No, no, lift up. Lift up, lift, lift up. up. and you reel down. Yeah, we we'll lift up. <laughs> lift up. Reel down. Too slow. Good boy, Ryan. Don't force it. Don't force Good boy, Ryan. If it wants to run, you let it run. Good boy, Ryan. Get him up. Get him up. No, no, you always keep a high rod tip. You make him fight against the rod. Okay, okay we'll just wait. We wait. Oh, there it is. Find it up. There he is. Okay, lift. Decent little strength. Lift him up. Did you bring a net, Jenny? We don't have a net. What? Guys, just caught a nice, just caught a nice bass off the jig. Over its, uh, over its bed. Wow, so nice bass. So there it is. Good boy, Ryan. gave up the traditional lure type fishing and uh, now we're doing some jigging that's our setup we got a little bullet weight with a uh, travel hook on it and so so far I haven't filmed yet but I hooked into a four or five pound bass and uh, didn't get anything going with that kind of snapped me off and then I hooked into a uh, jackfish my bad I got the hiccups hooked into a jackfish and uh, we didn't get that on film because it was just a quick catch and release because I got them in the gills. So um, let's see if we can get anything else up for you. Hey guys, so we only ended up jigging two of them. Uh, we jigged a pickerel or a uh, jackfish they call it here. And uh, we didn't get that on film. And then we foul hooked that little bass. And uh, we caught the striper early this morning. And tomorrow we're going to go striper fishing. So I think... I think we're gonna get striper fishing. So I'm gonna combine that video and this video. Tomorrow we're gonna be catching striper and doing a little more jigging. And uh, showing y'all how to. All right. What's up guys? I think I forgot to mention that we left a catfish line out last night. And uh, we got one, but we're gonna wait and let my brother grill this one in. So I'll we'll hurry up and get down here. Oh. Alright, we'll get back on it when we get it up. It's like a five or six pounder. Let me have some. That'll work right. Work right. Get him up. Oh, he's foul hooked. What's a foul hook? It's where you don't hook it up through the mouth. We need to unhook him. Yeah. Right here. You see how you pinched him up under his gill? Or I guess I did when I said the hook. Yeah. That's alright. Alright, here. I'm gonna cut the video. Weigh it. Nice catch, right? How much did it weigh? Uh, two and a half pounds. That's not two and a half pounds. No, no, it says two and a half pounds. Okay, let me check. All right, here, drop it. This will stay in place. Okay. Ryan, we go we go by pounds, not kilograms. It's six pounds. Two and a half and a kilo. Oh, yeah. okay. Nice fish. Alright, we're gonna catch one release. What? And then we'll try to get another one. Hey guys. Um, so we're back here jigging on a bass bed. And we're not having much luck right now. They're kind of busting me. So uh, I jigged a minnow. And I'm going to try to toss that in there. And then maybe jig it up under them if they get to hit it. But, uh, so I want to show y'all this is the, uh, jig setup. We have a little bullet weight with a treble hook. And, uh, 
what you do is you sit it there, and then when the bass come under, you yank it up, and it goes up through their stomach. So, um, we'll see if we can get something for you. I'm filming. He's right over. Yep, yeah, I got him, I got him, I got him. I think I foul hooked him. Oh! I can't tell if this is a or not. Either way, that's one down. Nice. All right, you can cut the. Yo, what's up, guys? So uh, we just finished up the fishing night, and I caught a bass on my last cast, and uh, we'll show y'all that in a second. But it wasn't a bad day. We ended up catching three bass, two of them on film, and then we caught the catfish, and we caught the striper yesterday morning. So we had kind of a crossover video. Um. So, here's the picture of that bass right now. Hey guys, I also forgot to mention, um, that's my personal best bass, because I'm kind of new to bass fishing. I usually striper fish and catfish. So, it was 3.4 pounds, which is pretty small, but I'm alright with that. So, if you liked it, uh, subscribe and comment, and thanks for watching.